Homeland Security. What will happen if we impeach Buhari, Senator Abaribe? Senator Ayinaya Abaribe of Abe South Senatorial District has revealed what will happen if the National Assembly succeeds in impeaching President Muhammad Buhari. We are waiting. We want to see what will happen. We want you to take that step and begin to prepare and plan on how to go about it. Nigerians are eagerly awaiting the Senate that we've seen are being docile, been towing the line of Mr. President. Anything he asks for, they have been brilliantly and approving, but we have not gotten anywhere near having a secure country. Rather, it's getting worse. But the Senate have been seen as an apron string of the executive. Well, Nigerians are waiting. We want to see the step and how far you can go. We hope and we want to believe that this is not for self aggrandization. This is not a plan to secure something for the federal government at the detriment of the citizens of this country. Disturbed by the increasing rate of insecurity in Nigeria, senators across party lines storm out of a plenary on Wednesday calling for the impeachment of Buhari as well as the Senate President Dr. Hamad Lawa. The lawmakers had on Tuesday expressed displeasure over the activities of the terrorists and bandits across the country without any serious action by the President. But were reportedly calmed down by Lawan and other leaders of the upper legislative chamber in furtherance of his effort at maintaining peace among the lawmakers over the matter. The Senate President called for a closed door session at the beginning of the plenary that later lasted for over two hours. But the Senate Minority Leader, Fili Baduda, raised a point of order for the Senate to deliberate on issue, issues of security discussed at the closed door session. Trouble, however, started when the Senate President interrupted him by saying that his point of order fell flat on the face since he didn't discuss it with him. And thereafter, he instructed the Senate leader to proceed with items on the other page. Angered by the development, all senators across party lines led by the minority leader Philip Tanimo Aduda stormed out of the chambers chanting, all we are saying, Buhari must go. Nigeria must survive. Ahmed Lawan should follow. And appearing on China television politics, Abadi said it was time for the president to go, having shown Nigerians that he was not capable of doing the job. According to him, Buhari had not done anything to show that he cared about what was going on. The Abia lawmaker said that if the Senate succeeds in impeaching President Buhari, then the person who takes over we know that his job is also on the line. Then any other president that comes in will know that his job can also be on the line and you do your work. The reason why you came out and vied for running for an office as strong as the president is because you told us, you gave us the assurance that you can do the job. Speaking for that, Barry said, you have to do things to show that you, are, you care about what is going on. The impression is being created very, very ominously that there are some method to this madness, that there are some collusion going on, that people are being left to do what they want in Nigeria, and you can go on the street of Nigeria, you get that impression, and if you are in charge, you need to do something to disabuse our minds, but nothing is being done, giving rise to everybody speculating. The impeachment moves may start with one person. It may start with two persons. As you could see, what happened today, nobody sat and planned. It was going to be a worker. People just got expirated. The reason why they expirated, is expirated was this Caribbean, Caribbean manner that the matter was being treated by the Senate president. The country is in their need of the urgent turnaround. And whatever needs to be done to turn this country around, let it begin.
people can no longer wait to 2023 because they seem the federal government is just not taking any step in the right direction to say yes. The people have confidence at the end of the day something good will come out of it. But the way things are going, hmm, nobody is sure. Like most Nigerians, most of the senators are cowardly. They only talk, no action. Town hall meetings should be passing vote of no confidence on their representative at the Senate and House of Reps. APC terrorist government, you must, well, you must read what you saw. Impeachment by foot. Because they come for they come for now in Abuja. They came in to Abuja now, all of Nadon scatter. Well, before coming into Abuja, everybody was calm and sitting down. Now that the thing is near near the seat of power, everybody is now shouting impeachment. Impeachment by foot. If people started late now, how many months remain for him to leave? Even if it is a night, you people should do it. Otherwise, small blood of innocent souls will be flowing like canine water. Two things to consider in capability and complicity. The Senate President and Buari are working on Plan A. Like this to hand over the state government to jihadist full and ex-men terrorists by back, back by ISIS, Eswa, Boko Haram, and Qaeda in lieu of the agenda of the Manfodio of 1804. Majority of National Assembly members are full and nice. They are collectively working on the agenda. It is too late for anyone in their minority in the National Assembly to turn the table around. Minority members have been silent to the detriment of Nigerians and themselves. The steps, the steps taken so far is in the right direction and it was long overdue. However, the ultimatum is quite too long. I'm not impressed. It is too late for Buari to go. There's still some foreign loans from China, which we will still have to approve for him. Still sharing their money. Now today, when you say Buari don't know anything but just to rotate that thing, that is is not but Buari they solve problem for Nigeria Republic. But lecturers the strike lecturers the strike here. Yeah. Bandits and Boko Haram and they will carry up enter Nigeria. Railway he do from Nigeria to the Jail Republic to give them unbridled assets. Well, my candid advice is that you guys should let him finish his tenure and allow him to go. I believe they are praying to be impeached. So too. There's nothing in this impeachment will not result to anything. They should have done this since. What were they waiting for? Senator, you have all tried. Why did you, why you, you just waking up now? Please go back and to sleep. It is still night. How long, how is long overdue? The house failed to take the bull by the horn, thereby toying with the lives of Nigerian youths in this country. They were chasing shadows instead of facing the reality on ground. Even at this point, they are still playing politics in everything. I want to let them know that should they fail to do the needful, what happened during the entrance will be a chess play. Well, the Senate wants to impeach Mr. President. Is the time not? Is it too late or is it too early? Kindly make your opinion known as you subscribe to my page. Thank you, good day, and God bless.